welcome back to Paragon Ridge Ranch. Today we are going to give our open and honest review on a product for chickens. This was sent to us by a company called Avivatin and this model is an AIR32 chicken coop. If it's easy to assemble, takes no time, I'm going to have the boys do it and we're going to see how well and how quickly that they can get this taken care of. Stay tuned. All right, we're gonna help the kids get this thing going here with little instructions from the instruction manual. So um, we accidentally just turned it upside down. So um, we flipped it the other way and we put it upside down. So now it should be right. Then we got this piece. And luckily it's all easy. It tells you. This piece here should be flipped the other way. Isn't that where their box, their nest box goes? No, okay. Here, I had it the other way. Okay. And according to that, it's. It's supposed to have the big box down. Let's see, Preston. Oh, I see. No, this is the that's right one. That's number one. So you shouldn't be using power tools, but if you've got a throttle control, you can. Otherwise, you'll strip it out. So the instructions call for just a regular hand tool. I didn't read that. I'm just, I, I know you're not supposed to. You can easily strip it out, but. So we got. It's because the wood is very thin. Very thin. Very thin. So that's why you probably don't want to use this. Yes. So we got the bait, the <laughs> main frame done. So now we got to get uh, D, C, G, and H, which is all the wire pieces. Parker, help him get the wire pieces. Underneath it.
Or did this supposed to be flat? Or flat on the bottom, round it on the top. It smells like wood. <laughs> yes, just exactly like that. Yep, I put it there, and then the other one I put on the other side. Yep, because it's gonna have a, a, a lid that moves up and down to get eggs. So yep, that one goes like that, and Daddy's got the other one. chicken to stand up underneath it, doesn't it? How many chickens do you think could fit in that? One. Three. Three? Probably about a three. Probably about three, three comfortably. That is a completed chicken coop there. Chrissy timed it. It took us 44 minutes, 44 minutes. The instructions aren't the greatest. Preston was able to figure it out though. That's that young brain there. Uh, but overall, I mean, it's a, it's a good coop. You gotta be careful with it, it's kind of fragile, but once you get it together, I think it's a little more sturdy. Uh, I think it's, it's probably a three full-size chicken operation I mean you might be able to do four but comfortably about three but overall I mean got these doors here got their little perches here got the clean out tray here uh, got the little nesting box back there they're all spring-loaded latches can access right here too oh so we are going to have to fix that there was a little tab hanging down on the back side to keep the door from going in like mm -hmm. that that was broke off but 
that's going to be easy to come up with something to keep the door from, from going in. Um, then you got your little access point here as well to get in here. Um, see, it's still got its piece to keep it from going in. So does this. Then we got your little access here. I didn't see how this worked because they did it. What do you do? Just turn that? Oh, look at that. Handy dandy. Get down here and get your eggs right here, your butt nuggets. Boom, 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 boom. It's just fine and dandy. Got some roofing material here. Huh, pretty slick, pretty slick. Thank you for joining us today. Please big, leave a big like and subscribe. And uh, if you're interested in a little chicken coop here, go check this company out. Description down below. See ya.